Yeah, well, I know it leads you in a spot, but I just got to go. They're having a seminar on fertilizer repairs, and I just got to be here. Don't give me any of your flimsy excuses. I'm awful sorry. I just feel terrible. That's fine, just fine. I'll make it on my own somehow. Naomi. You just run on to your little demonstration. But, Naomi! But... Run on me, sir. <laughs> Naomi, Sparkle! I'm going to have a mess out there. Now, you want to do some good business, I'm going to have to fix this mess myself. And if I have to read one more article about a two-headed baby that looks like Elvis, I am going to puke. Oh. Hi, you, Mildred. Don't you hide your big loser. You lied to me. I did what? You lied to me. You told me my car was going to be ready yesterday, and it wasn't. Now, when am I going to get it? Well, I'm sorry about that, Mildred, but your car has a certain size belt, and I don't have any stock in here. No later than next week. Uh, next week? Oh, but I need it by tomorrow. Well, I've got this loaner car you can use to uh, get it ready. Nothing like seeing that loaner car. You're going to drive that thing down the track. Oh, well, suit yourself then. <laughs> well, how rude. Well, that is the last time I do business down the Lubin team for sure. Mm. It's all Harry's fault anyway. Buy me these big old expensive cars. Next thing you just gas like I was drilling for in the basement. Uh, <laughs> what? Well, well, not not. What's wrong, honey? What, sir? Well, honey, what happened? He's supposed to take me to the crab competition. Well, she's gonna know. And now he's not gonna, because he's gonna go see some stupid jumbo fertilizer demonstration. A fertilizer? Yeah, and I just don't know what I'm gonna do. Oh, now, sugar, we'll find you another day. Oh, who? Well? Sure, he's going to be here and this afternoon. Bubba's going to play the triangle for face poetry. You can just go with him. But he smells funny. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he does not. Oh, Mildred, your old factory's on his sensitive response. Oh, I just don't know what I'm going to do. If I don't get a date, I won't be able to show my face in the happy heifer again. <laughs> oh, now, sugar. I'm sure that we are bound to find somebody in this town that'll take you to the art and craft competition. <sighs> no, Mildred. Let's face it. I've been ruined. I'm a fallen woman. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now, sugar. You know that if worst comes to worst, you can just always go with Harry and me. <laughs> but I'm the chairwoman. I've got to get there early. Oh, honey, I'm going to get there early, too. I want to get my ceramic depiction in a prime spot. Judges to see. <laughs> well, I know what you mean. I've got to get my Lincoln bust in there, too. You mean you entered something this year? Well, of course. Well, don't you think that's a little tacky for the chairwoman to enter something? I mean, don't you think it might influence the judge's decisions? Just a little bit. Melbourne, you know it's all done by numbers. Nobody knows who's it's who. Oh, yeah, right. Like you're the only one to enter that stink, ugly, god awful, goldy, crazy to us year after year. Stay ugly. You know, you would think just for once you might step yourself aside and give somebody else the glory. <laughs> and you think, good win? Well, you know, if this one horse town had any sense of international biblical culture, <laughs> they would surely choose my depiction of the Last Supper over your president series. <laughs> Mildred, I put a lot of time and effort into my sculpture. Uh, well, I didn't just exactly whoop that puppy up over breakfast this morning. Just come over here and look. <laughs> well, who's the guy with the chip beard? And this, this one's missing an arm. Oh, for the love of Oh, that Harry is so clumsy. I told him to be careful when he put in the car this morning. The guy with the chip beard is Judas. <laughs> and the FBT is Peter. <laughs> Mildred, you only started your surroundings after I became famous county-wide for my artistic abilities. One little sculpture does not a sculptress make. <laughs> well, you know, I wouldn't exactly call you the Michelangelo of Faith County. I mean, I wouldn't exactly put you up there with David or La Pieta. <laughs> 